How do you want Wax Lives? I think it's time to play a little Seven Days to Die. Alright. Things are... Ha. Can't remember what buttons to push. Things are quiet at the moment. I see that, then I hear a weird noise. It's a plane! Oh, nice. Potential goodies. You know, I found one of those just laying out in the middle of nowhere that apparently I had uh, not noticed dropping off things. I really wish you'd stop hitting the uh, wrong key here. Oh, well, this just takes me out to where those guys busted a big hole. <laughs> Still a long way to the top, though. Trying to get those... Trying to get those machine gun parts. Uh, I really... I've got, like, no ammo left. You'd think that, um... You'd think that this place would be full of... Hey, guy. You could, uh, I'm over here. Jeez. There's so many of them. Why are they not... Um... Here we go. Did I get hit? Because I didn't see me get hit. I just fell over dead. That was weird. My guy just... <clears throat> it's not my fault. He just keeled over dead. I don't know what happened. That was weird. That happens on this game. Quite a bit to me, though. I know I'm encumbered. I feel like this might be a long way from... Where I just left off. No, no, it wasn't. Oh, good. Uh, I should be able to just come out here, right? Aren't they just, uh... Yeah, yeah. Just come out there. Come around here. It's all good. Maybe we can figure out why I fell over dead. Hey, you. I'm over here. I'm literally right here. Whatever, guys. Y'all are weirdos. Weirdos! So, uh, <laughs> couple of weird things today. Um, I mean, not. Oh, now my thing is broken too. <laughs> My leg is sprained. And I'm like dead again. I got nothing. I got nothing to fix it. Death is going to be my only fix. Uh, so, got a message from one of my online D&D players today. He says, I'm lost. I'm like, what? He's like, I know where we're supposed to be going, but I don't understand how to get there. I'm like, what do you mean? I, It's just to the south. You just have to go south. This is not the right way. And he's like, well, I know that. But I don't know how to get there from where we're at. I'm like, you just... Say I'm, we're going to leave town and go south. What do you mean? And he's like, but I don't know where, how we got to where we're at. I'm like, well, I, I told you the direction to go. You went the direction. 
Um, there was a little town off to the east of where you were going. Uh, no, the west. A little town off to the west, and you decided to go investigate that town. And he's like, but how does that get us to the place we're supposed to go to? I'm like, it doesn't. Y'all chose to go with someplace else. <clears throat> I'm like, I don't know, man. I make this stuff up as we play. Uh, I just thought it'd be interesting to see a little, you know, other little towns in the area along the way. You're traveling outside, so... It's not like there's one town in the whole... The whole thing here. Uh, I don't know why you guys went there. I don't know why you spent so long here. You knew where you were going. You were in the tunnel, headed the right way. Decided to take a sharp right. Uh, I don't know what more I can tell you. And he's like, well, how do we how do we get back going south? I'm like, just say, I want to go south. Uh, so he, <laughs> he decides to go talk to someone to see if they can offer him. I'm like, uh, I said, uh, <clears throat> just because this town wasn't originally part of the plan doesn't mean there aren't things that can happen here. Oh man, look at all these guys. This is just, there's just so many things and I, I haven't got... Weirdly, I'm above them, punching down, and they're not hitting me. I'm going to take advantage of this weird placement bug. I think if I move now, I will fall and die. Oh, yep, here's where I fall and die. I've only got 21 bullets, right? I can't. I, ju I just can't. I don't have the ammo to fight all this stuff. And for whatever reason, the Shotgun Messiah has no guns and no ammo. Like, I don't know who's in charge. I'm deciding what loot spawns in a building. But it's a little too random. Right? Where's all the Shotgun Messiah boxes? If There should be weapons in this place. Um, yeah. I just don't get it. I don't get why I can't... Can't have nice things. Uh, so, uh... So, yeah. So that was a funny conversation today. And then I'm like, why would she know? I don't... People don't go to the ruins. I've told you this before. People don't go... To the ruins. And you're like... Can somebody take us to the ruins? <laughs> no. So they just told him, uh, go south. And uh, it's very dangerous. This wasn't the kind of information necessarily I thought that they would be looking for. Or even the person I thought they would talk to. Um, they're looking at a, a mining operation, right? And, uh, whoa. They just throw that guy off. And, um... I wonder if it wouldn't just be easier to go through this door here. Your head came off. So, uh, that was one. And then, so last week, right, I DM'd uh, a new game on Wednesday. Uh, and so the idea was to alternate uh, every week or every three weeks, depending when, uh, uh, depending when the other guy decided he was ready to run uh, a campaign. And so we're supposed to alternate. 
and I get a message from my DM today. Uh, you think you could run D and D again this week? I'm like, oh, I didn't think about that. He's gonna think that I can fill in now, cause he's lazy. And uh, he's like, I got a project I have to work on, and uh, I gotta get it done for Thursday, so I'm probably going to be working on it all day Wednesday. I mean, I could work on it tonight or tomorrow, I guess, but definitely, definitely going to have to be working on it all day Wednesday. I know what he does for a living. I also know that the campaign we're running is preloaded. Uh, unlike my campaign... Which is, uh, me loaded and takes a long time. Well, this is weird. Where am I supposed to go from here? I don't know. But yeah, I'm not uh I'm not too keen on having to take over him all the time. You don't suppose I gotta either jump up here. Oh, I guess I could jump that. I didn't think I'd be able to jump that, it looked too tall. Dang it. Ferals, this is where I needed my bullets. No! <laughs> well, I mean, I guess if they want to come after me, they're welcome to, because this is well below where I'm going to spawn. I don't think they'll stay there, though. That's funny. Oh man, here I am back to my max XP penalty. It's just where I stay. It's a little easier when I've got bullets. Once I get some more points into uh, my weapons, this won't be so bad. But uh, right now it's not easy. Yeah, I um I don't even have that much prepared. Um let's see the difference the difference between what he's running and what I'm running. We're both running pre made campaigns. Um but the way the system we use Roll Twenty works, uh you can purchase some of the adventures and they'll have all the maps and tokens and um, stat blocks and stuff like that are already done for you. And so that's what he's using. Is this where I came through? I don't even remember at this point. And uh, so the one that I'm using is pre-made, but I have like PDF files. And so I've got to... Uh, I've got to convert them into like single single images for maps and I've got to make my own tokens that go up on the screen and I've got to type in all of the uh, stat blocks and stuff like that. Oh, they came back. That's it. Oh, I don't know if I can get past this without bullets, man. Just don't know if this is possible now. I really kind of want to just pull apart my gun and see if I can get those last two parts that I need. 
Although, don't you find this ridiculous how much of this place I've gone through and not found, like, what, one Shaka Messiah box? Don't you think there should be more Shaka Messiah boxes in the Shaka Messiah factory? Let's just come on over here. There probably are, like, hidden ones that I just... I think there's one at the bottom of one of these towers and stuff like that. I just don't know where they're at. Uh, but I did uh, I did get some more of the game loaded up today. Um, more of my campaign. Um, I, uh, I just don't know what they're going to do. I, I mean, that's how it works, right? Uh, if you don't know, you don't know what your players are going to do. And so um, they're not done with town, but they've also been given a quest to go investigate these ruins. Uh, well, not ruins. Uh, it was a fort. And the fort was taken over by zombies. No. Uh, yeah, zombies. And uh, goblins and stuff like that. And so I uh, I had the first floor done because I thought there was a slim chance that we could make it all the way to there. Um, but I doubted we'd get that far. And so now... You know, he's like, oh, well, if you could... Oh, look at this. We just sneak around that mess. No, no, we're sneaking around. This is me sneaking around. I see you. Stupid buzzard. Why don't you guys have any eggs? Okay, so... Oh, there's another one. So I think this tower here has some in it. Aww. I was hoping to get out of here. Oh, jeez. Nope, it's the wrong button. Oh, yep, yep, yep. It's just... I definitely can't fight that guy. Oh, dang it. You guys didn't even give me a chance to look around. Alright, I guess I'm just gonna have to leave. I can't fight this stuff with the what I've got right now. I'm very disappointed. Very disappointed. I should have done spawn near, and then maybe they would have spawned me on the ground somewhere. I don't think we're too high up right now. I might be able to jump out a window here or something. Oh no, we're pretty high up. Alright, let's see if we can find our way back down. <laughs> uh, what was I watching? I don't remember what I was watching, but uh, dude was in the bathroom and was warning everybody that he's about to sit off a bomb in the bathroom. Uh, you know. You know what I mean. And uh, uh, some woman called the police because she thought he meant or some dude. Must have been a dude, right? Thought that he was said he was going to sit a bomb off in the bathroom. Like a bomb bomb and not just a uh, bad bathroom session. 
I thought that was quite humorous. Um, okay, I feel like I've gone backwards here, but... Oh. Whew. Wasn't certain that was close enough to the ground. We, we can go check out the uh, drop as soon as I figure out where I left my bike. Disappointment, man. It just takes too much ammo to go through one of these places. It's ridiculous. Uh, it's a lot. A lot of ammo. I think I probably went through three, four, maybe 500 rounds. All of my 7.62 ammo. I think I can make more. I think I can make more. I'll have to go home and find out. Um, but uh, yeah, so I got the I got the second floor map in place today. It's not done though. See, that's the other thing is uh, uh, one of the things because of the system we're using, they do this thing that's kind of cool called uh, dynamic lighting, and so what it does is it allows you to put down. Uh, you put down the map, and then um, you draw in where the edges are of things, like rooms and stuff like that. And then when the players put their tokens on the map, all they can see is what their players could see. And so they aren't able to see, you know, through walls or through locked doors or things like that. And... Uh, um, so when you buy a preloaded map, that's all done for you. Uh, when I load up a map, I have to go in and zoom in and use the mouse to draw where all the edges are at. And, uh, and then you have to do the same thing for the doors, which are like a, a, the same layer, the dynamic lighting layer. But uh, you have to have separate lines for them so that you can delete them when the players open the doors. Um, it's cool, and it doesn't, it's not hard to do, necessarily. But it does take time that I don't have to do by Wednesday. Like, if he'd have said last week, on, like, Friday, Hey man, I'm going to be busy next week, do you think you can run the session? It'd be a little different, but this is basically last minute, right? Hey, now that it's uh, 3 o'clock on a Monday, do you think you could have a whole session ready to go on Wednesday? No. I mean, I do, but no. That's not okay. Especially since I know your session is already done because we started it and you were ready to go with it three weeks ago and we're just continuing what we were doing last week. Uh, and it's not something new and it's not a new anything. And you don't have to put anything in because it... Oh, no. Because it's already in there. And stop pretending like you have to do these marathon prep for the session missions because you bought it preloaded, and I know that. Uh, okay, mini bike chassis schematic. Not that useful. First aid kit. Quest isn't useful because I've got no place I can turn it in. Uh, double. Double, um. Beakers, though, is pretty nice. When we get around to being able to make a... Oh, you know what? Can I make... I do have a chemistry station marked on the map, though, that I can use. Um, I was just thinking gunpowder. I, I need to be able to make gunpowder. I'm going to have to look into that. I also need to get down to some flat ground. This... Uh... Cliff stuff's going to get me caught. 
But, uh, yeah, I got all the characters loaded on the map, but now I have to do the dynamic lighting. Um, and I haven't put, like, I gotta roll for their hit points, and I gotta put in everybody's armor class, and stuff like that. Um... So, seems like a lot of stuff to do by Wednesday. If I don't get it done, I'll and they make it through what I do have in there, I'll just be like, that's it. Uh, somebody didn't warn me early enough so I could do this. Uh, it's not like I didn't plan on doing this, it's just that I planned on doing all this this weekend. Because next week is supposed to be my session, not this week. It's not even like an emergency or anything, right? It's not like he had a work emergency. He has a project that he wants to work on for work that he's going to use Thursday or later. And he could work on it today or tomorrow, but he's going to put it off. And, uh, and so then... Yeah, I still don't understand how this stops him from being able to... Because he didn't cancel Wednesday's session. He still wants to play. Uh, so it's going to take the same exact amount of time. Um, so I just feel like... Yeah, there's no reason for him not to run his session. The, uh, the other guy who plays with us, he uh, said he was thinking about running a session too, which I hope he does. And uh, so I had left him some notes about um, how long it was taking me to input a non-purchased um, thing and some pointers from things I was having to do to set it up. Um since he's never done one, and this is the first time I've done one, and the other guy was just like, do the tutorial, uh, instead of answering questions. And, um, uh, so, uh, I feel like this is his, uh, it takes me time to prepare, too. He's feeling like it's a little less special now because someone else is running a game. Although I do want to see what happens, so. It's not like I don't want to run the game. I just want to run the game under regular circumstances when I have time to prepare. And not just have lazy britches decide uh, I'm an excuse for him not to do it. Although, to be honest, I have had two other, three other campaigns either quit by him or canceled by him. Four? Three. Three other campaigns, I think. Uh, two he ran and one I ran that uh, he dropped out of because he couldn't be bothered to play. It's not a time thing. It is definitely not a time thing. It's a... Uh, I don't know what it is. I know, like, our online sessions, right, are, like, one was an online session, and he doesn't like to run online sessions, I guess. Not online. Play by post. He doesn't like play by post, because I'm not sure. Um, it actually makes it a lot easier to run, because people post a couple of things, and then you have, like, the whole afternoon to get around to looking at it and typing in a paragraph, maybe. 
and then it's just done. And then you wait for them to respond the next day or two. And, uh, right, it's super, super easy. Am I missing... Oh, no. That was weird. I am missing one of my pillars here. I thought I'd fix that, but apparently not. Well, I think this is probably a good place to call it. Uh, unfortunately, I did not make it through the Messiah. Shaka Messiah. Uh, let me see if I can make ammo. Seven. I can. Uh, bullet tips, gunpowder, bullet casings. Um, yep, I'm blind. Okay, uh, bull, bullet casings, bullet tips. We'll get those converted over. Um, I don't have a lot of gunpowder. Let me see what it takes to make gunpowder. Gun. Gun. Oh, I can just make it coal and niter. You just it just takes less. So I just gotta get some coal and some nitrate powder. So yeah, I should be able to make some bullets. Uh, I'll have to make a lot though. Uh, I might have to do some digging off camera here, maybe. Uh, if I can find the time. <laughs> All right, with that, be very on the small things, lean in the light, and I will talk to you later.